Okay, so this is a quick walkthrough of using Beamer, which is one of the R Markdown uh, systems that you can use to make presentations. So let me share my screen. And actually, I will stop my video so you can just see the screen. Um, anyway, um, so here is our, um, our code that we had from before. And I'm just going to go in and make a blank R Markdown file. Um, I keep calling this the two models um, package. And so here it is. Um, and then just right up here, instead of saying HTML or PDF or whatever, you just say Beamer presentation. And then you should have a good start. Um, whenever you use R Markdown, it's a good idea to save it. And I actually have a file um, saved from before. Um, there you go. So we'll just save over it. Um, and from there, then you're just going to copy um, your code over. And again, you can write over it. So um, I'm just going to take all the um, pregame stuff that you want to get done, and I'll put that into our setup chunk, just like you do. Um, otherwise, uh, I'm not going to edit the text. Of course, you would want to do that. Um, but we'll have our two summary statements here where we summarize the two variables. Um, And uh, then we'll make our little plot. And in fact, it's kind of funny because the little default uh, model here does one for summaries and it does one for plots. Notice that it does put echo equals false right here, meaning that it doesn't want you to show the code. If you want to see the code, um, you can do that. Oh, that's a little note that's right there. Um, then I'm going to just put a couple more chunks down here at the bottom so we can put our models. And I'll get rid of that note. And um, like that. And then I will put in, um, I'll actually copy the code twice and then fix it um, to there and to there. Make sure you do rename your chunk um, to do that. Remember, I had both models kind of braided together, <clears throat> but it makes a lot more sense to put um, uh, linear model and the summary of the little model in the same place. Then once you do that, you're ready to knit. Um, it does use LaTeX. So if you are having trouble printing to PDF, you're going to have trouble knitting to uh, Beamer as well. It always takes a second longer than you want. And here you go. So here is your plot. And um, again, you can see that it is all good to go. Um, <clears throat> you can then add in all of the other things that you can do to our markdown. You can add in fonts and style sheets and do all the things to make it pretty. Um, but if you like uh, PDF style slides, um, it's hard to go wrong with um, Beamer within our markdown. So there you go.